Hey, what's going on guys? Nick Heron here with the Fantasy Football Swagger Show. Just want to let you guys know that I did release my week three rankings. This is again half PPR. You've got quarterbacks, running backs, wide receivers, tight ends. And then I did also include a wide receiver, running back, tight end flex positioning in there as well. So you can kind of see where I rank these guys based on, you know, my information and what I have and kind of the research that I've done through the first couple of weeks of the season. So hopefully that'll help you guys out. Again, guys, I'm available to answer any start sit questions that you have. But if you would, go ahead and actually take a look at the rankings first because it's kind of frustrating to me when people ask a question like, hey, who should I start between a guy that I have like ranked fifth and a guy that I have ranked like 28th? You know, I get questions like that all the time. And again, I'm, I'm happy to answer them for you guys. But uh, at the same time, though, again, if you would help me out, Make it a little bit easier on me because I do get a lot of questions. And again, I, I appreciate that, guys. But um, again, if you would go ahead and actually take a look at the rankings, see where I have them ranked. If you're in a full PPR league or, a, or in a standard scoring league, it shouldn't change the rankings too much. Some guys, you know, like your obvious players, your, uh, your Danny Woodheads, your Shane Vereens, maybe your Antonio Browns, your Julian Edelmans, those type of guys might rank, rise up the rankings just a little bit in a PPR format. They're not going to go up like 20 spots or anything like that. And even the guys that don't catch many passes like an Alfred Morris for example those guys might fall down just a little bit in a standard scoring league but again it, they're not going to change drastically they're not going to go from being you know 10th to 30th or something like that that's just not going to happen so just try to keep that in mind guys hopefully this will help you out though with the rankings this week again if you guys have any questions be sure to tweet them at me at click with tv or of course you can leave them in the comment section here on youtube and i'd be glad to answer them for you Thank you guys so much for all the support. Hopefully you guys are going to have a great week of fantasy football this week. And if you guys want to help out the show, do us a favor. Check out DraftKings. We've got a link in the description below. Uh, oh, and by the way, guys, I don't know if I mentioned this, but it should be pretty obvious at this point. Go ahead and look in the video description below or in the comments section below. I will leave a link to the... Um, to the actual spreadsheet where I have the rankings, by the way. Uh, but as far as DraftKings go, we do have a, a partnership with DraftKings. So if you guys are interested in trying out daily fantasy sports and you guys want to get involved in some of those weekly type of games that you can do, uh, go ahead and check out DraftKings. Again, the link will be in the description below. That's the one that I use. So hopefully you guys will join me over there. Uh, and if you use our referral link, that'll help us out just a little bit as well. So thank you guys so much again for all the support. Enjoy your fantasy football week, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye-bye.